This is my uh, first YouTube video for League of Legends. I'm not really going to try to show you the best way to play support or anything like that. It's just sort of what I got dealt with this game. I I don't ever uh, call a roll, so I, I usually get stuck playing support. I don't... I don't, I don't, uh, I don't play like a real, um, like dedicated support. Like you can see I have, uh, AP runes on my, uh, support Soraka, which is a little interesting. It's just the way I like to play her, but, um. Uh, some people don't don't like to see um, a support like that. They like uh, uh, having the su support uh, masteries and the utility tree, like having Explorer's Ward and those weird cookies. But um, yeah, I like I like playing uh, with a little punch. So I have some AP, and um, I'm gonna build a little bit that way. Uh, I'll still have support items, but. Not a whole, uh, whole bunch. I'm already getting a little distracted. I'm not used to, uh, talking while playing League. I'm gonna go ahead and get heal first, because Ezreal's getting beat up. I I think Ezreal should do fine in this lane. Um, I I'm a whole bunch of uh, of sustain, and Lulu can't really heal. So uh, Ezreal should just be able to do a bunch of damage, and not really get bullied out of lane if he plays smart. He is taking uh, a few hits, but he's giving it back. He doesn't have too many more health pots he has to burn through on Caitlyn there. I'm gonna... Now that I have level 2, I get infused, so I could start uh, giving him some mana along with health. So, uh, so you could see right there, we uh, we pretty much won that exchange. Caitlyn's hurting. I think she's burning through her last health potion right now. He has to be a, a little careful because I can't really do any damage. There we go. Go, 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 go. There we are. See that that turned out real nice. What I expected to happen, really. Um, so yeah, I, I don't see any problems in our lane right now. Um, Ezreal should just be able to win this pretty easily. That's why I picked Soraka to go with him, because um, as uh, as burns through mana pretty pretty fast. So, uh, Soraka with her Infuse can give it back to him. While she, um, at least the way I play her, I don't like to, to be, like, right up front trying to, trying to help harass, um, the enemy, because, um, I don't have, like, any sort of armor or anything, so I, I tend to get beaten up myself, and, um, you know, not being a tanky support, me taking damage for Ezreal is just going to make him more worried about committing to a fight because it might get me killed and then that's not helping him at all. So I I am going to stand uh, kind of behind Ez, but I, I want to be close enough that if anything happens, if they kind of initiate on him, I can, I'm still within range to help kind of uh, pressure them back.
It's important to put words around. That's why um, I buy words every time I go back. Caitlyn's really using her advantage on range right now. Ez needs to stop uh, dancing back and forth and just uh, focus on um, using his mystic shot at maximum range instead of letting Caitlyn get free hits on him. See, like, that happened because he, he was stepping into the bush, uh, chirped a trap, and that was just the end for him. Uh, Lulu was really good at um, disabling the enemy. So Lulu um, morphed, morphed, um, morphed uh, Ezreal into, like, a little squirrel or whatever. And, uh... And then he wasn't able to get away. Like, he, you can't use any moves while you're uh, polymorphed. I'm not sure what it's called. It's I think it's polymorphed. Not totally sure. But, uh, Holy Christ, Ezreal. He is just diving in there. He's got, like, revenge syndrome. So I took um, a second level of healing because Ezreal definitely needs it. Um, he's pretty much tanking two people. He doesn't really need any extra mana. He can use the health. I burned my flash escaping from the jungle gank, so I can't initiate with it. Lulu's pretty good. I'm, uh, I sort of uh, faked out... Um, an initiation there. I stepped forward for an attack and then immediately backed off and uh, and Lulu responded with uh, her Q. I'm not, I'm not, I don't know what it's called, but uh, <clears throat> she did react very quickly to it. There we go, there we go, come on. There, yes. Uh. Oh, goodness. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to think about getting some cooldown reduction because, um, you know, he needed that two seconds earlier than I got it back. Can't really get it. Um, I'm probably gonna just get this instead, and probably get cooldown next, uh, because this is a gold per five item, and supports really need uh, that sort of gold generation. Um, supports aren't allowed to get minion kills. Like I got one. It was probably from my starfall. I don't think I've been auto attacking at all minions. Can't say for sure because I'm I I consider myself thoroughly distracted by um, the narration, but I don't think I was auto attacking to get that one creep score. But uh, I feel we're doing pretty pretty solid bottom. Yeah, I'm kind of sorry I had Ezreal eat that for me, but um, I didn't want to die. And I could get level 6 pretty soon. Ah. Damn, just got 6. I'm kind of baiting her. I got both my heals ready. But I think she knows. Go 
She's uh, burning through her health potions. I don't want to alt for it. <laughs> Though she definitely wants it. I can see it. I just don't... I'm not really doing any damage. I only got one level in, in both of my damage abilities. So you can see how powerful that, um, I almost stole that from him, uh, with that auto attack, but you can see how powerful the heal is already, just, uh, from my AP build. was nice. Um, I wanted to kind of put that into infuse, but even though his mana is kind of low, he he goes back often enough. I'm gonna put another ward down. Um, Shaco can easily get pay, past those, but um, he seems occupied in other lanes. I'm not worried about him showing up. So yeah, we're we're doing good in this lane. Um, I I uh, we're kind of even at six and five. I'm not sure what the other lanes are doing. I'm a little surprised Renekton's beating Darius back. I mean, I um, it's just my personal belief that Darius should be a little bit stronger than uh, Renekton if played correctly. Um, I haven't played Darius top against Renekton enough to really know. I don't really know what Ezreal's doing either. I mean, jungling at this point doesn't make any sense. So yeah, that's a little odd. I don't know what he's doing, but um Um, I guess I'll just let him do what he's doing cuz uh Kale came down to help. Um, I saw Shaco up in river, so I think Kale should be just a little cautious. Uh, Darius and Renekton took each other out. Um, I think Skarner was there. I mean, Skarner didn't get an assist, so maybe he just sort of, like, showed up and scared Renekton. I'm not sure. But I, I assume Darius should be able to just take Renekton out easier, you know, as time goes on. Um, he doesn't scale as great in the late game because, uh, his damage sort of just gets capped a little bit. I want to wait and see if she tries to ult me. I don't think she has the mana. Like, she's itching to do it, probably, but I don't think she has the mana to pull it off. So, um, I'm waiting to see what Ezreal's do gonna, gonna do. He, uh... He's not t making terrible mistakes, but... I'm just trying to keep him in it, like, come on, Ez, get this shit done. Oh, great. Tried to follow, uh, Skarner past the tower, and he, uh, he was able to outmaneuver me there. I didn't want to blow Flash, I thought I was actually going to survive that second hit.
But it looks like, uh, actually Caitlyn killed me. She must have been in the bushes. No, she couldn't have been. Ez I thought Ezreal killed her. I don't know. I, 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 I was distracted by talking, so I don't know. I thought, I, I thought Ezreal actually got her, but... I don't know what happened. <laughs> I'm probably going to go ahead and get this for uh, cooldown reduction, the Ionian boots. And, um, it's going to, you know, pull double duty there. I'll get cooldown reduction and speed, because they're boots. Uh, I'm also going to buy uh, a health gem towards a sight stone, because that's sort of just something support should buy at all times. I'm gonna start warding dragon. I mean, I should have been warding dragon already, but because it looks like it's gone, I'm not sure who got dragon. Uh, probably them, because because Shaco could could solo dragon pretty easily with his ultimate. Oh, what is going on? Got distracted again. <laughs> so yeah, that's a little bad. I didn't mean to do that. And there she flashes for it. So that's that's an example of what not to do. Um, looking past the creep wave and and uh, moving. Because I ended up running right through it. Ezreal's item build isn't ideal. Um, but I feel he should be doing a little better. Like, um... Like, if he just got a little more aggressive and focused Caitlyn, I think he could be killing her every time he sees her, but, um... I don't know. He seems to be playing just a little more passively than I prefer. So it's not a it's not a big problem, because I am... I'm a little... off my game here, being distracted, but, uh... But, um, you know, I wish he would be just a little more uh, conscious of what's going on. Um, pushing bottom alone while they're pushing middle. I don't know what he's doing. I warded River, so hopefully he will notice when they come for him. Like they are now. I see Caitlyn there in the river. He's, she's moving through jungle. Uh, don't, Ez looks like he's starting to move off now, yeah. I'm glad I didn't have to point that out to him. That <laughs> that would have been bad if if he was completely oblivious to the map. Oh well. Wow. It looked like she used flash right there. I saw the um, the particle sprites for it. Maybe she felt like she uh, we were still chasing her through the um, fog of war. But right now we got Shaco coming up river. And there's Renekton. I uh I I used infuse on him to silence him in case he wanted to try to uh slice and dice forward onto somebody and stun them. The uh silence is a is 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 a decent peel move even though Soraka isn't really like a peel champ. Um, the silence will prevent people from using stuns and whatnot when you're running. This uh, dragon ward's doing its job. I just I don't think we're gonna be able to make anything of it. Nope, it doesn't look like anything got accomplished. It's it's a little sad. Um, 
uh, I think Skarner needs to be a little more aggressive. Um, him and Darius are two tanks. I, I'm not going to lead the charge into that. So, you know, Skarner's got to make the plays. Um, so that was a that was a fail on uh, Shaco's part. I think he probably expected Caitlyn to help him out, but that just would have gotten her killed too. She didn't have enough health to to really assist in any way. I still think Ezreal could have uh, made a little more effort to get Caitlyn because she did come in for like a harassment shot, but um. But yeah, he he just he seems to be playing really conservatively, and I would prefer it if he was just sort of forcing his advantage a little bit. I don't see why he shouldn't. I mean, it's a little more risky, but if he plays good, it's it, there's really no no way he can screw that up. It is his advantage. Shit! Oh, there we go. I was worried she might have put that too close to the wall for me to walk around it. Alright, so, um... Doing good. I'm starting to run out of mana. Um... I don't have any regen or anything. Usually, um, usually it's not a problem. I mean, I'm not usually blowing a whole bunch of spells in rapid succession like I have been, but uh, but um, you know, we had a pretty serious fight there. I was using my Q, and that's a that's a bit of a mana drain. Uh, I'm just I'm sticking with Ezreal. That's the support's job. So whenever he feels like going back, I will. Um, I can get my sight stone now. It looks like Lulu's warding, so I could get a vision ward and take it out. But I'm not too concerned. Um, Dragon's not going to be up for another f three four minutes. So I didn't I didn't grab the timer on it. That's. Uh, Again, I'm I'm kind of distracted by video taping here, so I am not doing a great job, but I feel like I'm doing <clears throat> good enough, at least for the team. At this point, I have to decide, um, you know, I have a little bit of money. I can start building towards my next item, and I think, I think I'm going to help Ezreal out and get um, a Zeke's Herald. Um, I don't know if anyone else is building, uh, like, a uh, Armor of the Legion. I might get that afterwards. I mean, that's a really good team item, the, the Legion, but, uh, I see Skarner get it a lot, so... So maybe he'll go for it before I'm even in position to actually get one. I'm getting pinged in the middle here, but uh, um, they should realize I'm, I'm putting wards down. That's just as important. I think she flashed over the wall. I didn't. I didn't see it, but um, I have a ward there in that bush, and I didn't see her go past it. So she must have flashed. There goes Darius. I mean, he's doing good, so... As long as he comes back, I don't think we're having much of a problem. I mean, he's doing what Darius does best. Get a lot of health and uh, just start uh, queuing team fights. And uh, I haven't seen him do it at all yet, but... Um, 
the possibility for kill stealing with his alts there always present. That that's what makes Darius fun in my opinion really. It's uh, just seeing him dunking people with his ult. Even if he doesn't deserve the kill, it's just it's a very impressive uh ability. I have to kind of stick with Ezreal. I mean, I am the support, keeping up with him, but uh, it's it's kind of hard for me to justify hanging out with him in the jungle when I'm not really worried about him getting ganked in the jungle. Even if they had ward in the jungle, we would have some sort of indication they were going for him just from our coverage. All right, dragons up. They're moving towards it too, it appears. They got it last time, so hopefully we can make a, a stronger showing. Alright, so, yeah, we got Dragon, that was good, um, maybe they want to fight off the back of it, I'm not sure. And Ez is being like a giant wimp here. Didn't put any, any damage sort of on the back of that, I mean... I believe he could have like at least scared the front line off just by just by throwing some moves at him. But he's constantly running back. Like he'll throw a move and then he'll just eat all those auto attacks in his back. He's got a bloodthirster. I think he should try to like rely a little bit on his um life steal instead of just eating free damage. Uh, I don't feel like there's a whole lot I could be doing to sort of turn this around. It's it's really just on Ezreal here. He needs to be making plays. I don't think he can do a whole lot against, you know, what they have arrayed against us, but I think that he should be using his moves a little more defensively rather than how he has been playing them, like... Like, I think he should have ulted before the tower even went down so that they would, uh, you know, just try to push the minions off of it by time for reinforcements to arrive. But, I mean, he waited until it was down before he even ulted. Um, I'm not, I don't think they're actually in our jungle. I mean, they were like, they were here, but I doubt they're actually still here. But I'm going to put some words down just to keep it safe. I like Kale, that, you know, Kale's being so aggressive, but uh, it just, you know, that, that, that one fight over here you know, illustrated that Ezreal just doesn't seem to to feel like um, really committing to a battle. Uh, so I hope we're gathering up here, or going back, that's fine, um, Caitlyn's pushing bottom, Renekton, and Lux in the middle, uh, they might be gathering there, but Ezreal's alt's inbound, so that's gonna slow him down a bit, I'm gonna push this out a bit, um, I don't want, um, I don't want these minions stacking up bottom, 
Skarner's signaling me to be careful, but I mean, I have some ward coverage. I'm not worried about them sneaking up on me. They're probably top, or in this general vicinity. Some of them may have even backed, I'm not sure. No, it looks like they're focusing middle again. Um, I think I need to go over and, and make an effort to put a, a ward on Baron just since they're kind of hovering over there. Let's give some mana to Skarner. Um... Heal him up, alright, and give some mana to Kale. Heal there. I don't want to use my alt yet. Um, it's really sort of a like an emergency measure. So I'm gonna just try to keep everybody filled up by my normal abilities. I'm still really slow, I mean these guys are fast. Uh, Kale's fast with her heal and Skarner's fast with his shield so it's it's unrealistic for me to try to keep up with them but I, I do feel a little sluggish. So I'm going to go ahead and ward. I'm going to get one on uh, Baron. I'm going to get one in their jungle on the Baron approach. And I'm going to put one near Dragon. So this one will let us know if they're moving towards Baron and have eyes on Baron. And then the, uh, the Dragon one's just keep an eye on them moving up and down river so Shaco is moving up here what's he up to? Renekton's behind him they awarded Baron um, I'm not sure if we're ever gonna make an attempt at Baron so since I have no room, I'm not going to worry about pink warding it and trying to trying to clear out wards from Baron. If we do do Baron, it'll probably be just a spontaneous thing. We'll just you know we'll probably just see an opportunity to do it and then go for it. Alright, so they they probably warded our dragon approach because they immediately noticed when we were going. They're starting to starting to maneuver down here for a dragon fight. It looks like we're waiting for Darius. They have to have a ward here. I mean, they shot as unless it was just a lucky blind shot. Alright, so we stole Dragon again. They're not, they don't, they, they really don't want a team fight. <laughs> and Renekton, uh, he made a good attempt there. I'm gonna alt just because there's some seriously wounded people here that I can't get to in time. Um,. Ah, crap. Just not quick enough. I flashed. I tried to exhaust her. Uh, Caitlyn just didn't make it in time. Ah, oh, god damn it. Ah, oh, stepped on her trap and it 
bought the tower enough time to focus me. So Caitlyn did a good move there. Um, I didn't want to back off because, you know, Skarner would have really bitched me out. It's always the support's fault when something bad happens, so... It would have been bad if Skarner died and I backed off. So here we got uh, Zeke's Herald. Um, I suppose I'll go ahead and buy uh, a Vision Ward just to clear out Baron. And um, for my next item, I'm probably going to wait until I got 1400 for the Reverie. Uh, that's not something I'm going to sit in base and wait for, but next next time back at uh, well, I'll buy the Reverie. Uh, the wards are just now going, so I gotta get those back down. Which also means they'll be making their move to uh, reward Baron, because uh, Shaco Shaco was warding over here. So I saw Lulu. Yeah, uh, she probably warded. I'll take that out. So there we go. Um, I took out their sight on Baron. We killed their ADC. But it uh, looks like we don't want to make anything of it. So I'm just going to stick with the team. I don't get to make any decisions. It's just something you have to live with as support. You know, uh, Baron's available if we ever want to go over there. But uh, it looks like we're... I don't know what we're doing. Clearing out the jungle, maybe. Darius seems to be trying to lead this uh, <laughs> this mob <laughs> through the jungle. Wow, I didn't expect them to surrender. We never really had a decisive team fight, so that's a little surprising. Um, if if you bother to watch this whole thing, um, you know, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about it. Um, I'll do more videos if anyone likes them.